Shrimps are good. It looks cold. I'm seeing my breath. But it's not that cold. It feels good. The, the vibes of the day it makes you a little warmer. Opening day, Rockies Cubs 120, the best start time. I wish every stadium in sports was like this. It's not. This is special. It's unique to us. How blessed are we? Happy opening day. It's the best. It's been precisely a year since Eddie professed love for White Sox stage. It ruined my opening day. I love White Sox Dave. <laughs> How much he loves fucking baseball. I love Dave, man. He's so funny. I fucking love him, man. People think I'm like, I want to fucking have it out for him. I really don't, dude. He makes me laugh harder than almost anyone. We're hoping to get the same result today, but it's a tough start with White Sox Dave not being here. All right, we're at Cubby Bear. Freaking Miller Light. You guys already know. We got some good music, some fucking classic rock. say that he had poopy pants this morning. So my tummy aches. Oh. <laughs> he had poopy pants. He had poopy pants. We've all been there, but like, there's no poopy pants on opening day. He's got, he said, he's got, got a poopy got pants frame of mind. He said, I got some work to do. What do you want? Respond to the fucking White Sox group chat? That's not work. <laughs> they're all in three. What is, what is it? Eloy's hurt again. What are you going to do? Is he actually? Hey, hurt again. <laughs> I don't root for injuries, but that is funny. I root for White Sox Dave injuries. And Eloy injuries are White Sox Dave injuries. Get better soon, Eloy. That's another thing, too. I know it's going to get blamed on me. Ed, why did you text Viva to tweet that? I did not. I had nothing to do with it. Honestly, surprised this guy hasn't been taken. Uh, I'm going Wal Walter Payton. Um, I, arguably one of the best running backs of all time. Um, similar run style to Barry Sanders, I'd say. No, they're Beaner. opposites. You don't think so? No, he was like Barry – Walter Payton was like not an athlete. He was like – Whoa, whoa, whoa. That whoa, whoa, might whoa, have whoa. been – the with respect to like other running backs he wasn't he was like a slower smaller guy he was all fucking he, willpower he was he, not slow. he wasn't a burner at all he was never ever 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 considered a fast running back he returned ever. kicks he was one of the that, best blocking running backs ever. He's one of the best receiving running backs ever. He played quarterback for like a full game against the Saints. Cannon. I don't know why they play. I truly don't I'm know done, why. I'm done with this. Dave said that. <laughs> Own up to it. You said it. Now it's on the Walter Payton, not an athlete. Chief just said that and we got weird looks. Getting in the Christmas spirit now. And I down a Wrigley hot dog. Best hot dog in Chicago. Thanks. Come all, at me. All beef Vienna this way? Uh, a lot of gold lands cannon. Best hot dog in the city. Oh. Wrigley Field, baby. The Lance can. Can we get that as a sound bite? For now on, when you put it around. <laughs> the Lance can. Go on for a dog. There's dogs all over. Oh, this one over okay. here. All right, Chief's got a specific friend. Guy puts burrata on his hot dog, I guess. This is the place to go. Grilled dogs, right field. That's where you go. That's how we're starting the season off right. Well, it's the same thing. This guy doesn't know shit about hot dogs. Yes, I field. do. It's a same this is a guy who didn't set a personal record for hot dogs or games attended last year. I did. Set a PR, not to brag. This is the only grilled spot. Hot dog was my first food. I popped out of the womb and I ate a fucking hot dog. It's the same. Then you should know that these are grilled. This is the only grilled, grilled spot there is. Grilled is key. Grilled is big. Apologize. Not from a vendor, but there's, there's other hey. grilled. Admit you were wrong. There's other grilled spots. Right, then go get it. No, this is the only grilled spot. This is the only grilled Can't spot. True. Go walk around. Take a lap. Can't be true. I might get three and just Kobayashi in the gift shop. <laughs> How do you be dipping those buns in water for no reason? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, fuck up. Chris Bryant, hero, 16. 
MVP, 15. Sparkling blue eyes, I can see him from here. Oh, Chris Bryant would have had that routine ground. And Morel is a work in progress. It's all right. It's just day one. Day one, he's going to figure it out. But Chris Bryant would have had that. How you doing? A little yeah. bit of an update. Shout out to Big Cat. Aerotechnics. You see John Greenberg do a tweet. That's one of those moments where it's like, thank God we won a World Series. Because <laughs> that would have been the last. <laughs> oh my God. That's a bad pyro. That's a bad pyro. Oh, what's up, boys? Do this every day. I used the hell out of working. Get your hot dog count at. I'm at two. Mincy make yours too. I know. I, I uh, want a hot dog, but the five that I ate on Mincy Hot Dog Day has me a little scared. Yeah. You know how like stupid and old I'm getting? Yesterday was the anniversary of uh, Fukudome's home run. If you had asked me on Saturday if we had won that game, I would have said yes. I just memory hold the fact that we lost an extra inning. We lost an extra. We lost an extra. Right? I, I saw the clip and I was like, wait, what Pretty the sure fuck? We lost? I remember it being a walk-off. I was here and I was yeah. like, <laughs> game ended in the night. That was a great day though. Best loss of all time. And yeah, White Sox Day didn't come because he said his tummy hurt. Oh, what a pussy. Cody Villager. He doesn't like baseball anymore. No, I know. Why? I just I, I hate him. I should have asked you, my bad. Well, you, what you did, you what do you like, hate? Like basically everything that's on that hot dog. Pass it over then, bro. Pass it over. I'm sorry. All right, now I'm on pace for 162, dog. They're just like, you want everything on? I was like, sure. No, it's fine. What do you usually get? It's, I've tried to keep it a secret as long as I can, but <laughs> it feels, just, I, I feel like opening day. It what it sounds like. <laughs> no, I, just, I, I would raw dog it. I don't know. I don't really eat hot dogs that often. I don't raw dog You and Andrew, bro. Don't let it pop. I like raw dogs. It's not really a hot dog That's fine. But I also. Look, I got a little. I go pretzel pot, pretzel in the pot. <laughs> <There we go. laughs> Keep it warm. That, that has no business fitting in your pocket like that. Uh -huh. Not even pretzel. The rest of There's a reason nowhere else in the world they eat, do they eat hot dogs that way. The you reason what? is that it's not good. <laughs> you think it's like a fear factor stunt? It's how we like it. If it was that good, they would do that everywhere with hot dogs. They don't. But it's just, there's something a little off about people from Chicago, and that's okay. I was gonna say three hundred dollars, but okay, we'll do a hundred dollars. <laughs> you know, we'll do two hundred dollars. I feel like we'll do three hundred dollars because that's gonna, gonna be the winner. We'll do three hundred dollars. Three hundred dollars. Because the winner's gonna be in the last three hundred. I know okay, that. Okay, here we go. Three hundred. Three hundred. Yeah, yeah. Nine hundred numbers. Okay. Yes. <laughs> she says, "Are you serious?" That's the first three hundred. And my boss just brought me extra papers. That's the CVS receipt right there. This has been multiple times where I've bought the and they have to get extra paper. I mean, you made her take a seat. It all goes to a good cause, Eddie. Pull them out. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. I love you. I like that, though. It's like covering like a section of the yeah, roulette board. Some seniors do randoms. I think these are all just in order. Yeah. So, like, there won't even be, uh, the winning number won't even have a five, and I'll be just throw the whole thing out. So I'll let you hold your first 300. We're going we're gonna to measure it out here. Thank you. It's like a, it's like a super fruit roll up. We're on 879. Don't pull, don't pull. All right, don't pull. See, I only got, and I guarantee you the first number is going to be one when they do the winnings because I all, all I have is fives. You want any more? Right. No, I'm good. Oh, okay. Actually, come back in a couple innings. All right. <laughs> Full fly down to this picture. That's, that's, that's your guy's fault. <laughs> oh, we have the zip on your No, just tell me. I didn't notice. Until I saw the picture. The wind's blowing in today. The wind's blowing in. It's opening day for the fans too. I have that clip. I was not too. Hey, go away. And this is Danny's, Danny's uh, grade school song right now. Hey, you remind the camera what your favorite Lil Wayne song is. Uh, movie study mob. It's a good one. Starting to rain. Starting to come down. We got the ponchos out. 
people scatter into the concourse. It's rain. Nobody likes to be rained on. All right, so a little bit of a rain delay. So we came to Country Club, Old Faithful. We have a couple beers here, right out this Cubs game, and uh, cheer on our guys. That's all it is. We got five nothing now in the seventh. Kind of feel like we might uh, left a little early with that rain. We got scared off by the rain, but vibes are good here. Can I say this now? Because I know Davis is a big proponent on anti leaving early. I have zero shame of leaving early. I will leave after the first. If it's rainy and cold, I will leave after the first with a smile on my face. I went to that White Sox game for a prop with onions. I did that before the first pitch. I was good at it. Are we really going to be hard to be like, like, as if watching it from your couch warm whatever, with whatever you want isn't better? For those who don't know, that's Big Tom from Country Club. Uh, he faced off against White Sox Dave in the bartender challenge last year. Lost drastically, and more importantly, about 10 years ago, he had a username on the Barstool site saying, Fire White Sox Dave 69. Look at him now. That's Fire White Sox Dave's blank ass. 2013 commenter.